I'm James I'm a Gamer. Uh, welcome back for a brand new video. And yes, it's my birthday. Um, I was born uh, the 10th of the 2nd, 1978. Uh, it was my birthday on Friday. Uh, just so you know, this video will be up today, uh, Saturday the 11th uh, of February uh, 2023. Uh, I'm super pumped, I'm super hyped. Uh, it's game pickups. And uh, let's see what games I picked up. Hello, hi, I'm Jason Gamer. I'm uh, back with a brand new video and it's game pickups. So what games did I pick up? Um, yeah, I've been on the CX store um, local, uh, just near where I live, uh, Northern Ireland, where I'm from. Uh, so let's see what games I pick up. Most of them are from CX and it's a second hand store. And so I'm super hyped to do this video. And uh, so let's, let's dive straight into this. Um, so here we go. Uh, a little bit of your order. Um, I wanted to get this game uh, in the collection, and that is Need for Speed Undercover for the PlayStation 3. Uh, I paid £3.50, and I thought it was a great deal. Um, doesn't come with the manual, but as I say, it comes with the disc. And check out the artwork, that is super awesome. Love the details in that. Uh, Need for Speed is one of my favourite racing games. Uh, as part from Forza Horizon, it's probably one of the best racing games, Forza Horizon. Uh, I have it on the Xbox Game Pass. So, um, and another game I love is Ridge Racer. It's another fantastic game. Ridge Racer 2, I think I have Ridge Racer 7 on the PS3. Um, yeah, Need for Speed. Um, Never go wrong with Need for Speed, uh, super hot pursuit game. Uh, so I've got that for the PS3. Uh, next game I picked up, I didn't thought I had this in my collection, um, that is Dead Space 3. Uh, it wasn't one of the best uh, Dead Space games made. Um, apparently, that was saying it was a co op uh, campaign uh, single player, uh, so it was a co op shooting game. Uh, just didn't feel like the story of the game but uh, I preferred the first Dead Space and Dead Space 2 uh, and then there's the remake of the Dead Space that's out at the moment um, you, can, you can download it on the PlayStation 5 or um, digitally but uh, fortunately I don't have a PS5 I have a PS4 and so I'm too expensive to pay uh, for a PS5 um, and uh, there's my PC and it's updated so I can't play the Dead Space remake but well at some point we'll get grab my hands on a PS5 um, or maybe update my uh, PC and we'll see what happens guys but but I love Dead Space it's one of the best survival horror games uh, I would rather the first one uh, part of the third one but it's just nice to get the third one in my collection as I say I paid five pound uh, CX hand store, second hand store. Never go wrong with another Need for Speed. Uh, I've never played this. Uh, this is Need for Speed Heat for the PS4, and I think the new one is Need for Speed Unbound, or is it Bound Unbound? Is the new one? Um, yeah, I think it's only available on the PS5 and Series X Xbox. And so this was the last of the Need for Speed Heat uh, come out for the PlayStation 4. And it was awesome to pick that game up. Yeah, super, super excited. Uh, there's the bag of it off the case there. 
same company that does Ghost. Um, so leave your comments down below uh, if you see these games I'm showing you. Uh, drop your comments down below, guys. Big fan of Grand Theft Auto. Um, I picked up Grand Theft Auto the Trusty, uh, definite edition. Uh, it came down in price a bit. Um, I think you can get it a little bit cheaper than that, but I think £28 is a great, great deal. Uh, if you do find one around 20 quid, uh, you can maybe search around online or, but uh, I've seen it in CX, so I wanted to grab it, so £28. Uh, it includes Grand Theft Auto 3, Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Grand Theft Auto Vice City was my favourite game, and Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Um, there's the two games, the three trusty games. Be awesome. I do have the downloaded game uh, digitally on this, uh, but I wanted to buy uh, a physical copy as well. Um, I think I have this on the Game Pass on the Xbox One, uh, so I thought I'd just get the PS4 version of it. Um, so it's pretty cool. Right. Big fan of the RPG games, uh, fighting games, anime games, uh, as you know. Um, I picked up Kill the Kill. Uh, I love the anime series of it. Um, great game to, to dive into. Um, uh, yes, it's a great story. The Kill the Kill anime writer uh, perform the fascinating combos with your favourite character. Um, looking pretty forward to watch this, um, to play this game. Uh, super hype. Uh, so that's Kill the Kill. Finally, I picked up the last story for the Wii. Uh, I was looking for this game for a long time and it's uh, paid £48 in CX second hand store. Uh, I just love the art on this game, it's fantastic. Uh, it's complete with the Mino, which is pretty nice. I'd uh, love to get that game, but I finally picked up this game. It's very hard to find in the wild. Uh, the last story for the Wii. Um, Wii, I'm not playing too much Wii games at the moment. Um, just mainly my popular games like Mario Galaxy, Mario Kart for the Wii, uh, Red Steel 1 and 2, and so on. Tomb Raider Anniversary, if you've seen the photo on my Instagram. Uh, so check out my Instagram, it's jhamagamer. And a uh, big fan of Tomb Raider, uh, but I finally picked up this game, uh, so I can't wait to dive into that uh, at some point. Only one 3DS game I picked up, uh, as you know, I've done videos on the 3DS eShop, and they're closing down the, uh, the eShop uh, digital games. Uh, but if you download the, the <coughs> excuse me. If you download the games digitally on the eShop, on the Nintendo 3DS uh, or any Nintendo um, 3DS or 2DS console, uh, when you download them, they're yours. Uh, so, but uh, they're closing in March sometime, in the middle of March, so I'll probably stay tuned and we'll do a video on 3DS again on the eShop and see what games we'll find. Uh, so I'm super excited to do that video. And uh, yeah, I picked up the Teenager Mutant Turtles. I uh, never played this one. Uh, 3DS, £3.50. Uh, Stop the Evil Uprising, which is pretty cool. Uh, so yeah, can't wait to play that. Um, there's a big surprise coming after these two games. And I picked up two Switch games. And that is Street Fighter 30th. <clears throat> I picked up two Switch games, Street Fighter the 30th Anniversary Collection and Cobra K the Karate Kid Saga Continues. So those are the two Switch games I picked up. This is pretty nice to have. Starting to enjoy it, I love the Switch. I've um, been playing at Steady, uh, Mario Kart Deluxe 8, and they're playing it for the weekend and so on. And Super Smash Brothers uh, done a video on that last uh, what Tuesday passed there, um, so I'll leave the links to those videos at the end of this video. Uh, so I picked up these two games uh, at CX, uh, what was a great deal, Street Fighter 30th Anniversary Collection, £28. You get all the Street Fighter games, Super Street Fighter 2 and so on, which is pretty awesome. And big fan of Cobra Kai, uh, the Karate Kid Saga continues, 
pay 25 quid on CX, which is pretty awesome. So those are the two Switch games, which we'll have fun playing at some point. See, my games, my backlog is absolutely piled up. Um, uh, a lot of games to play at the moment. <laughs> So that definitely will be my last game pickup video for quite a while. And uh, so, because it was my birthday, so uh, happy birthday to me. And uh, so, why not treat myself to a few games? Uh, so, quite a few games there. Um, and a big surprise. Um, you will be wondering what's at the end of this video. And I picked up Super Nintendo uh, Mini Classic. I picked this up at CEX, uh, what a deal guys, what a grab this, I had to grab this and it's in good condition, boxed, it comes with a Mino, the two controllers, the HDMI, the USB for the charge point, um, 20 plus 1 games and I paid £105 and in CEX, uh, so uh, those are the games, it has all the classic games there guys. Um, Absolutely fantastic. That was my favourite part of the video at the end was to pick up this mini classic Super Nintendo and I would love to buy the actual console uh, Super Nintendo uh, Street Fighter 2 box turbo one but they're rare to buy at the moment and they're expensive. So I got this one the mini classic you get all the games on this uh, and you got Mario Kart so you got Super Metroid Final Fantasy 3, um, Legend of Zelda, The Link to the Past, uh, Control 3, Secret of the Mana, love that game, Super Castlevania 4, one of my favourite games, um, Kirby Superstar, um, Street Fighter 2 Turbo is on it, uh, awesome, and Star Fox, and so on, the list goes on, and I think you can maybe program this into the computer and you can emulate and put more games on to that. But stay tuned for the next video, I'll be doing an unboxing and testing on this mini classic Super Nintendo. Uh, so stay tuned for that. So a lot of good stuff there on my video and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. And uh, I, yes, I've watched the Nintendo Direct. Um, I'm excited what games has come out this month and beyond. I'm super excited for the new Zelda game, is it the Tears of the Drop, is it something like that, I uh, can't remember, I think it's out May time, and the new, I think the, the Metro, Metroid Prime um, remake, or is it, you can download straight away on the eShop on the Switch, uh, yep, yeah, so, uh, and there's also old games, uh, Game Boy Advance games as well, uh, if you're uh, Switch members, uh, clubs uh, you can join uh, so much membership you pay a month I forget how much I pay but I'm actually free online at the moment uh, for three months because when I pick up the switch for Christmas uh, so I have three months free so we're in February now so it's probably be coming near to my end of my free membership uh, I think it's March uh, before it's yeah, I start paying but anyway guys, uh, thank you for watching and have a great weekend guys, uh, drop your comments down below, uh, feel free, um, the games I showed you, uh, what was your favourite game in my collection that I picked up, uh, mine was the mini classic for Super Nintendo, um, then the last story, uh, those were the two games that draw my attention, so yeah, so give it a thumbs up guys, subscribe to my channel as always and have a good weekend, take care guys, I will see you next time, uh, bye.